All right, here we go. This is the big one out here. This is a Hitachi EX1000 um, hydraulic front shovel. I've been waiting to see this one for a long time. This is an old machine. This is from uh, 1990s. And uh, you can definitely tell it's been well used because these at one point were double grouted pads, which uh, they kind of are now. Not really. They look like that at one point. Um, this is a cool machine. Really high up there. You're about mm, 10 feet off the ground when you sit in the cab. Um, it's a really big machine. Um, you get your front shovel configuration hydraulics, basically. You got your linkage for the bucket to scoop the bucket and just for basically dumping it. But you also have where this bucket opens itself up right in there, along there, and right here, done by these hydraulic cylinders in here. You also have two hydraulic cylinders here working the rest of the bucket. And you have two hydraulic cylinders in a uh, different configuration than most where they're normally, if they are, they're set up like that, but due to space, they are uh, on top of each other basically. And these are big hydraulic cylinders that's probably four or five inches across for the cylinder. You got your Tachi logo way up there, your cabs you got great visibility out of this cab, but you'd need it for loading mining trucks. Um, we're just going to do a quick actual around the machine, and then I'll show you up in the cab. Yeah, this has been scraped up against some piles before. Definitely. Got your drive motors for your uh, tracks down here. I'm guessing there's probably another one. This machine, it's a very heavy machine. I couldn't find specs specifically for this one, but the, here, what are you doing? But the EX1100, which is only slightly bigger, is a very large machine. All right, up here, get your engine. Oh, that's engine, basically. Huge machine. Got maintenance up there, and then you got very large hydraulic lines going to the actual bucket. Okay, up here we got you're basically standing on a catwalk. A little bit of fun. The cab. Like I said, this machine was made in 1990, so it's a pretty old machine. Nothing really fancy on it by any means, but you still got basically standard excavator controls. I'm not exactly sure of the operating pattern because I've never been in or around front shovels before. But I'm thinking, you know, it's all works just like any other excavator. Except I'm thinking you got... And now, please, correct me if I'm wrong because I tried looking this information up, couldn't find it. You got these pedals here that open and close the clamshell of the bucket, basically. If anyone knows, I'd please comment and share. But it uh, does have AC, your RPM, engine RPM, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. You stand it up really tall so you'll be able to see uh, loading into any trucks. So, it's definitely a cool machine. Thanks for watching, guys. Please uh, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Have a great day.